Namaskar. Today we will discuss about regional metamorphism of mafic oblique basic rocks. In this we will discuss how a basic composition change during metamorphism right from geolite phases up to the gamolite phases. Regional metamorphism of mafic oblique basic rocks content introduction barovian phases third type of protoliths fourth metamorphism of mafic rocks and fifth conclusion regional metamorphism is a metamorphism that occurs over a broad area most regionally metamorphosed rocks occur in areas that have undergone deformation during an orogenic events resulting in mountain belts that later have been eroded to expose the metamorphic rocks. On the basis of pressure and temperature, we can divide the metamorphic phases into three types, mainly phases of low pressure, second phases of intermediate pressure and third phases of high pressure. Myosiro originally recognized three different phases series. First, a zeolite, prehanite, pumpelite, blue six eclogite type. Second, a typical Barovian type characterized by green cyst, epidote amphibolite, amphibolite, gaolite type characterized by paragenesis of kyanite, sillimanite type and third an abukama type of green cyst, amphibolite, gaolite characterized by the paragenesis of andalusite, sillimanite type. Regional or Barovian metamorphism cover a large area of continental crust typically associated with mountain range, particularly subduction zone or the roots of previous eroded mountains. The regionally metamorphosed rocks cover during an orogenic events, the collision of two continental plates or Iceland arcs with continental plate produce the extreme compressional forces required for the metamorphic changes typical of regional metamorphism. The phases of intermediate pressure or Barovian type are listed below in order of increasing temperature and pressure of metamorphism. That is first geolite phases, second is your green cis phases, third is your amphibolite phases and fourth is your gamolite phases. The Barovian phases series occur in a number of Paleozoic mountain belts as well as in some of the pre cambrian age. The classic region in the Scottish Highland, other belts with a Barovian rocks occur in Colorado, British Columbia, Alaska, Venezuela, Spain, Southern Europe, Asia, Japan, etc. pre cambrian belts of Barovian rocks occur in the Black Hills, of South Dakota, the Rocky Mountains, Labrador, Ontario, Canada and the Singhbhum in India. The Paleozoic orogenic belts are clearly associated with convergent plate margins both Barovian and the Buchan phases series developed as such margins. In convergent zones, regional heating due to rise of plutons into the overlying plates, the plate above the subduction zone is the general cause of metamorphism, but migrating fluids may also be transport heat. The zone of metamorphism in the Scottish Highland originally described by Barrow in 1893 includes six index minerals that is chloride, biotite, almondine, garnet, stolite, kyanite, selimanite, etc. 
the lowest grade in the zeolite phases which form under condition just above those of the diagenesis assemblages is characterized by the clay minerals assemblage may include kaolinite, elite, chlorite, quartz, analcite. At slightly higher grade condition assemblages of the geolite phases are replaced by those of the prehenite pompelite phases. As the same PT condition increase the green cis phases assemblages with new minerals form. Typical assemblages in peltic include white, mica, chlorite, chloritoite, quartz, albite, magnetite, biotite, epidote, garnet, pyrophyllite, kyanite in an almondine zone of green cis phases. The green cyst amphibolite phases boundaries is a broad zone. The disappearance of albite marks the maximum upper limit of the green cis phases. Thus, albite like pyrophyllite is absent from amphibolite phases rock. Stolite rather than chloritoite occur in the lower part of the amphibolite phases and aluminum silicate, kyanite at lower grade and silimonite at higher grade characterize aluminous bulk composition. The gaunlite phases is distinguished by the general absence of white mica and presence of orthopyroxene and plus minus cordite. The pre-existing chemical composition of the rock is responsible for the mineralogy of its metamorphic offspring. When we normally study the metamorphic rocks, it is essential to keep in mind about the parental composition of the rock. In fact, the chemical composition of the rock protolith can only provide the important clue towards deducing the parents. We can keep certain sedimentary and igneous rocks into six important compositionally based groups. First, ultramafic rocks, mantle rocks, cometite and cumulates very high Mg, Fe, nickel and chromium. Second, mafic rocks, basalt, gabbro and some gravex high Fe, Mg and calcium. Third, cells or peltic rocks, the most common sediments, fine grain, plastic clays and silt deposited in a stable platform of or offshore ways, high Al, K and Si. Fourth, carbonates or calcareous rocks, mostly sedimentary limestone and dolostone, high calcium, magnesium and CO2. Fifth, quartz rock, cherts are oceanic and sands are moderately high energy continental clastic, nearly pure SiO2. Sixth, quartz of felspathic rocks, arcos or granitoids and rhyolite rocks, high Si, Na, K and Al. Although these six categories are to a degree gradational and they cannot include the full range of possible parental rocks, but they do cover most types which are responsible for metamorphic prospectives. Amphibolite, a metamorphic rocks dominated by hornblende plus plagioclase. Amphibolites may be foliated or non-foliated. The protolith is either a mafic igneous rocks or grayback. Ascola define metamorphic faces on the basis of metamorphosed mafic rocks, also called metabesides. Characteristics of minerals, the principal minerals changes in metabasalts are due to the breakdown of 
two most common basalt minerals that is plagioclase and clinopyroxene as temperature is lower the more calcic rich plagioclase the high temperature igneous plagioclase in the albite and orthite system becomes progressively unstable the low metamorphic grade only albite and orthite 0 to 7 is stable in the upper green cis phases oligoclase and orthite 7 to 17 becomes stable the anorthite content of plagioclase thus change from 0 to 7 to 7 to 17 as the grade of metamorphism increase and is seen and more calcic plagioclase become stable in the upper amphibolite and gaolite phases clinopyroxenes break down to number of mafic minerals these includes chlorite, actinolite, hornblende, epidote and a metamorphic pyroxene etc. and are commonly diagnostic of the grade and phases. For the regional metamorphism of mafic oblique basic rocks, we have to compare all the phases of intermediate pressure that is geolite to granulites in view of major change in mafic rocks only during metamorphism. Regional metamorphism of mafic basic rocks during geolite phases. Very low grade metabasites are usually partially altered to a very fine grained rocks prior to the work of DS Clombs and co-worker in New Zealand, such rocks were written off as altered and did not receive much importance from pathologists. In New Zealand, during July phases of metamorphism, volcanic glass is altered to the geolite hollandite along with clay minerals like kaolinite, montmorillonite plus secondary quartz and carbonates. We can find out the important mafic assemblages during geolite phases metamorphism with the help of ACF diagram. The first assemblage is your chlorite plus hollandite or lomentite plus calcite plus quartz plus albite. Further increase of pressure and temperature the geolite phases move towards prehanite, pumpelite phases and actinolite. During this change, we can observe the following assemblages. Assemblage 2, chlorite, prehanite, calcite and assemblage 3, pumpelite plus actinolite plus chloride in upper part high grade. Further increase of pressure and temperature, the pumpelite disappear as rock enter the green cis phases where it is replaced by actinolite plus epidote. Important reaction, first anal sign plus quartz give rise to albite plus water. Second reaction, hollandite give rise to lomentite plus quartz plus water. Third reaction, lomentite plus calcite give rise to prehanite plus quartz plus 3 water plus CO2. Reaction number fourth, lomentite plus prehanite plus chloride give rise to pumpelite plus quartz plus water. Reaction fifth, pumpelite plus calcite plus quartz give rise to epidote plus actinolite plus water. The green cis phases include the common products of low grade regional and dislocation metamorphism. The metamorphism of mafic rocks is first evident in the green cis phases which correlate with chloride, biotite and almondine zones of the associated peltic rocks. Although relate igneous textures 
may be preserved. The mineralogy reflect re-equilibration to metamorphic condition. Green cis faces are characterized by the abundance of green color minerals, for example, chlorite, epidote, actinolite, and quartz. The association of albite and orthite, nearly seven, and epidote is a characteristic of this phases. Furthermore, chlorite in the presence of quartz and muscovite. Other diagnostic minerals are mica, muscovite, and biotite. Microclean, pyrophyllite, kyanite, garnet, and hornblende, etc. Mafic oblique basic assemblages in chloride zone. We can observe the following basic assemblages with the help of ACF diagram. Assemblage 1, albite plus epidote plus chloride plus actinolite, oblique tremolite plus minus quartz. Second, basic assemblages in biotite zone, there is no major change in basic assemblage or mafic assemblage during biotite zone of green cis faces. The basic assemblage is same as in chloride zone that is albite plus epidote plus chloride plus actinolite plus minus quartz. Mafic and basic assemblies in almondine zone. During almondine zone of green cis faces, almondine rich garnet and hornblende appear for the first time by the following reaction. FEMG chloride plus quartz give rise to almondine plus Mg chloride plus water, chloride plus actinolite plus epidote give rise to hornblende plus water. We can observe the following mafic oblique basic assemblies with the help of ACF diagram. First assemblies hornblende plus epidote plus albite plus minus quartz. Second assemblies hornblende plus epidote plus almondine garnet plus albite and plus minus quartz. In the higher pressure of Barovian zone, hornblende appears before oligoclase and a transitional albite epidote hornfels phases proposed by different workers including Ascola may be useful in higher PT terrains, in low pressure temperature terrain and in contact areoles the plagioclase transition occur first. Metabasites in the amphibolite phases are characterized by the assemblies hornblende, plagioclase, and orthite more than 17 percent with less amount of quartz, epidote, garnet, clinopyroxene, and biotite. Epidote usually disappear in upper amphibolite phases that is stolite, kyanite, sillimanite, orthoclase zone in associated peltic rocks in an ACF diagrams, we can observe different mafic oblique basic assemblages during this phases of metamorphism. Right from stolite zone, kyanite almondine zone, sillimanite muscovite zone, and sillimanite orthoclase zone. Mafic oblique basic assemblages during stolite zone. Assemblage 1 hornblende plus plagioclase plus almondine plus minus epidote plus minus quartz and plus minus biotite. Assemblage 2, hornblende plus plagioclase plus minus epidote plus minus quartz and plus minus biotite. Assemblage 3, hornblende plus diapside plus plagioclase plus minus epidote plus minus quartz and plus minus biotite. The derivative of mafic oblique basic rocks in amphibolite phases, many of them are garnetiferous coexistence of plagioclase, anorthite 25 to anorthite 45 with epidote is a common in these rocks. Important reaction, reaction first, tremolite plus 3 calcite plus 2 quartz give rise to 5 diapside plus 3 CO2 plus water. Reaction 2, tremolite 
plus chloride plus quartz give rise to hornblende plus anthophyllite plus water. There is a no basic major change in assemblage of mafic oblique basic rocks changes during metamorphism of other zone of amphibolite phases that is kyanite almondine zone, sillimanite muscovite zone and sillimanite orthoclase zone. The gamolite phases is characterized by the presence of large anhydrous mineral assemblages in metabasites. The important mineral assemblages is orthopyroxene plus clinopyroxene plus plagioclase plus quartz. Garnet is also common and minor hornblende and or biotite may be present. Hornblende may remain stable in metabasites in the lower granulite phases, but dehydrates in the upper granulite phases. The texture is generally nisic and green shapes are granular, thus bearing no resembles to the original basalt. The origin of gamolite facies rock is complex. Gamolites represent unusually hot condition. They present temperature excess of 700 degrees centigrade. Important reaction, a number of metamorphic reaction have been suggested to count for the diagnostic appearance of orthopyroxene. Reaction first, anthophyllite breakdown and give rise to orthopyroxene plus quartz plus vapor. Second reaction, hornblende plus quartz give rise to orthopyroxene plus clinopyroxene plus plagioclase plus vapor. Third reaction, hornblende plus almondine garnet plus quartz give rise to orthopyroxene plus plagioclase plus vapor. Disappearance of hornblende and anthophyllite marks the beginning of the gamolite phases. Basic and mafic assemblies during gamolite phases. The important assemblages we can observe with the help of ACF diagram is as follows. That is also known as anthropite, that is basic chapterite. Second example is protein plus 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 minus plus minus plus is also because in this case both parts are present. Fourth assembly is plus minus quartz. The course content of a real of mafic oblique rocks begin with the introduction followed by the description of interaction characteristic of mafic rocks the detailed comparison from geolite to gamolite phases with the help of ACF diagram. Important reaction and changes due to the progress of mafic rocks. Thus, on the basis of the detailed history of different phases, also with the support of experimental data, we can conclude that the appropriate metamorphism Beside, and two paragraphs are formed. Thank you very much.